This is Muhammad Hamoud speaking. Today we are going to continue and talking talking about the translation of limited access technology texts. Last lecture we we talked about the translation of open text and we differentiate between open text and limited access text and we said that open text usually it is a type of texts which include or which is which are available to all people in general regardless their uh, cultural background educational level or level of education or even their gender uh, and their age and so on it is available to old people as well as young people it is available to highly educated people and to less educated people uh, also it is available for women and men girls and boys in general so uh, open texts that uh, will, uh, are the texts which are available to all people in general while limited access text is a text which is limited for a specific people and it is highly specialized it contains a lot of specialized terms today we are going to investigate this type deeper okay now let us talk about let us start with the nature of limited access texts actually it is defined as the text which is limited or it has a the text which is which has a limited access to a specific to specific peoples only to specific people it it is a text another another time a limited access text is a text which is specific uh, uh, which is available to specific people okay such as the direct of a company it is given under a, a special request a formal re request from the specialized person whenever he wants to create a web solution after seeing an advertisement offering the service okay so it is actually it is available to specific people also it is given under a formal request from a specialized person and it is used as it uh, it uses or it is sent via a secured channel i mean it is not available but it is sent it is sent via a secured channel such as personal emails, uh, faxes, uh, price quotation, and so on. So it is not available via internet, uh, openly I mean, but it is available under certain circumstances. Most of the time it is sent through a channel or a secured channel. Okay. Uh, now also, okay, I want to go limited access, uh, actually also as uh, open text, as we said, open access text is a multifunctional text because it addresses uh, all people in general in the society. At the same time, limited access text is a multi-functional text because it has several functions we have one predominant function and then we have also several less important functions which support and highlights uh, which support and highlights the predominant function so we have several functions yes they vary in terms of their importance some functions are more important than other functions we have more more important function 
and we less import and we have also less import more less important function but at the end we have several functions in the limited access text so limited access text is usually a multifunctional text okay uh, also a very important issue that we let us go to the practical issue to the practical part and we investigate now the first type of circulated terms circulated terms these terms these technical terms are highly daily occurrence during ordinary discussions they are they occur a lot in everyday discussion related discussions related these discussions related to computer sciences and internet activities huge uh, in general so these circulated terms usually uh, are reoccurring terms uh, in ordinary discussions and conversations related to computer sciences and internet activities uh, actually these terms such as logo finishing feedback mobile version facebook twitter uploading and downloading uh, tagging and linking items thumbnail and the traffic uh, okay regarding logo the, tra the first translator render it as char and the second translator also renders it as Shark. So they share and they introduce the same rendition and this rendition is acceptable and comprehensible. Okay, so uh, logo can be translated into Shaar. Uh, the second item, finishing. Finishing al-injaz. وضع اللمسات الأخيرة. طيب. لو إحنا حكينا وضع اللمسات الأخيرة it is less technical terms it is a less technical term okay but al injaz it gives us or this term or this word al injaz gives us finishing a, a technical job i mean we have a technical job or a technical uh, work and we have finished it up okay or we have finished this work uh, so, uh, it is better to render finishing into an injaz to keep the same technical degree and the same technical value of the original word, while وضع اللمسات الأخيرة is less technical. Yes, it indicates the meaning, it, it, it reflects the intended meaning, but at the same time, it reduces the technological and technical uh, value of the text okay Facebook feedback it is acceptable in both renditions because and both translators render it as actually feedback is uh, has feedback as a word has an equivalent term in Arabic and this equivalent term is and it is used widely in Arabic uh, daily life, okay, or in daily life for the Arab people. Okay. Mobile version, نسخة الهاتف المحمول, and the second one is النموذج المتنقل. طيب, نجي لا mobile version. Actually, mobile version it is a mobile application version okay it is a software برنامج, runs the mobile phones and the smartphones and it is designed to assist customers to handle daily tasks okay نسخة uh, الهاتف المحمول and النموذج المتنقل النموذج المتنقل is a literal is a literal a translation uh, and we notice that uh, 
uh, النموذج المتنقل is less technical it is not highly technical uh, word or expression while نسخة الهاتف المحمول is more appropriate than النموذج المتنقل why because uh, the translator or this rendition takes into consideration the context of website proposal okay so it is a kind of application نسخة الهاتف المحمول is a kind of application or refers to a kind of application which is in, installed on the mobile to conduct specific tasks okay so it is نسخة الهاتف المحمول refers to application installed, installed uh, on the mobile while النموذج المتنقل it does not refer to uh, an application that runs uh, a smile phone or, a, sm or a smartphone or a mobile phone okay so it is better to translate it into نسخة الهاتف المحمول Facebook actually Facebook is rendered as look at Facebook okay صفحات الفيسبوك وتويتر صفحات فيسبوك and تويتر actually uh, both renditions are acceptable because Facebook and Twitter are widely used in Arabic uh, most of the time the adaptation or transcription of these two words into Arabic is uh, is acceptable uh, while Twitter Facebook does not have an equivalent term in Arabic while Twitter we have a tagri that uh, as an equivalent term but actually a tagri that or the equivalent term is less used than the original term Twitter okay so uh, it is acceptable to render it as a Twitter or as Facebook uh, the, then Uploading and downloading. رفع وتحميل الملفات تحميل وتنزيل الملفات. طيب نجي. Upload and download. These two terms refer to the direction or indicate the direction of uh, transforming the information. Uploading uh, the direction will be from the user or into his laptop or into a website while downloading the direction is from the website into the computer or into the personal laptop of the user okay or the user's personal laptop okay so Rafa indicates the uploading indicates the direction Tahmil uh, does not indicate the direction uh, Tanzil, yeah, Tanzil indicates the direction So, uploading is better to be rendered as Rafa Al-Malafat Downloading is better to render uh, to be rendered as Tanzil Al-Malafat Because Rafa wa Tanzil indicate the direction of or indicate the directions of information from uh, okay طيب. tagging and linking items وضع اشارات وربط المحتويات وضع علامات وربط البنود طيب نجي وضع علامات وربط البنود عبارة عن literal translation while وضع اشارات وربط المحتويات is more comprehensible and it refers to uh, a technological or a technical context. وضع إشارات وربط المحتويات refers or indicates a technical uh, context or indicates a technical situation. While وضع علامات وربط البنود does not necessarily indicate a technical context. Okay, so it is better to render it as وضع إشارات وروابط المحتويات. Thumb, nails, مصغرات والصورة المصغرة Both of them are acceptable and indicate the meaning 
ترافيك مشاهدة عالية وحركة مرور اكتشلي حركة مرور is legal is uh, a general context uh, a literal translation and it does not indicate the technical context at all okay while مشاهدة عالية indicates the technical use of this word uh, in internet okay uh, now what we have discussed all of these now to move to talk about document bound terms uh, these terms are related to documents exchanged between two parties or more okay look at scalability plugins cross browser issues and so on طيب نيجي ل the first one uh, scalability قابلية التوسع قابل لل... للاستيعاب والتوسع طيب قابلية التوسع is a literal translation and also it is acceptable but قابل لل... للاستيعاب والتوسع is more acceptable than قابلية التوسع why because indicates the future possibilities or the possibilities in the future to be expanded okay so the future possibility or expansion is indicated in قابل للاستيعاب والتوسع while it is not indicated in قابلية التوسع but both renditions are acceptable and reflect the intended meaning or reflect the majority of the intended meaning okay plug ins الإضافات والإضافات المساعدة both of them are acceptable while الإضافات المساعدة is more clarified or الإضافات المساعدة clarifies the uh, use of plug ins or the nature of plug ins more okay cross brow browser issues قابلية دعم كافة المتصفحات والتوافقية مع متصفحات الويب طيب uh, actually قابلية دعم كافة المتصفحات it is the Arabic equivalence of cross browser issues and it is not literal translation while قضايا المتصفحات المشتركة is the literal translation uh, actually قابلية دعم المتصفحات uh, is Uh, uh, refers to the intended meaning and it keeps the technical context and the technical value. Okay, طيب. Flash header, flashia or flash, actually uh, flashia Okay. Flashia is can be used flash يعني هاد الفلاش اللي احنا بناخده اللي احنا بنستخدمه طيب آه فلاشية هانا التاء المربوطة it is translated as a flash and then uh, a syntactic change is used when we when the translator adds the تاء مربوطة into the flash because it may to make it or to make it feminine okay to make it feminine okay okay uh, let us you can read these examples uh, regarding the abbreviated terms a lot of using uh, we have we have talked about abbreviations a lot uh, where the playlist is تطبيق WordPress أو برنامج إنشاء وإدارة المدونات اللي هو WordPress actually this translation is more acceptable than the first one why because it reflects the function of this program 
while this condition does not indicate its entire function uh, also content management system نظام إدارة المحتوى أو نظام إداري إدارة محتوى الويب نظام إدارة المحتوى أو نظام أنظمة إدارة الحاسوب CMS both of the conditions are acceptable لغة البرمجة PHP لغة البرمجة النصية uh, actually uh, the addition of uh, النصية limits the nature or limits this a programming language into a specific type of text which is النصوص or النصوص فقط and while لغة البرمجة PHP does not reflect or does not specify a specific text or a specific text type uh, okay using Photoshop and we have طريق استخدام برنامج الفوتوشوب إلى لغات الويب التالية باستخدامنا لبرامج الفوتوشوب ولغات البرمجة مثل لغة Actually both of them are rendered and acceptable both of them are acceptable renditions Okay, that's the end of this lecture I hope you get a lot of benefits Thank you and this is the end of the whole course I wish you the best in the final exam.